literally the second that I try to film someone's birthday or graduation or something, there's endless amount of honking, freaking the lawnmowers decide to do all their business now, even though it's almost 7 p.m. at night and the neighbors are talking so freaking loud next door. And it's also super hot in this room, so I have to open the windows or else I'm gonna die. So, that's good. Welcome back! What's up guys, it's Angelina, and we're here for another movie commentary, and today, we're gonna be watching Get Out. If you guys follow me on my Instagram, you guys know that I wanted to do a special movie commentary that is in support of uh, the black community in the movie industry. And uh, there were so many suggestions that you guys gave me, but it's like a good balance between a social commentary, but also it shows, I just hit my mic. It's a good balance between the social commentary, but also black creativity and representation in Hollywood. So yes, that goes without saying that I have seen this movie before once, I think two years ago. Before we begin, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on all my socials. Uh, all the handles will be in the description below. Um, I will also be linking some donation sites and some petition sites in the description below, so make sure you go check that out. Let's just go straight into the movie. I still have my little activate windows on the side of this because I haven't activated windows yet. I don't know, it's like 20 something dollars, 30 something dollars, and I'm just so lazy to do it. So please bear with me as I try to crop it out or place my face in front of it. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna sw it's, it's hot and it's a scary movie and I'm annoyed by the background noise outside. Ugh! An hour and 44 minutes of high key stress. Hell no. Yo. No! Oh my gosh, the music is like kind of creepy too. Okay, see, but this is what I'm saying. Like, isn't Rose supposed to take him? Like, there's a little discre- Unless- This is probably like the weird brother. Even the photos that they, they he hangs in his apartment is kind of- That's like- That's literally a foreshadowing picture in his apartment. Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize until now. What the freak? Dude, wait, this is gonna be cool watching it over again because I can kind of get everything that I missed. Oh god, even like him like shaving and her like picking out a dessert. Ooh, uh, just like little connotations that they leave there that I just didn't notice in the beginning. This is crazy. Oh my gosh. Wow, I didn't realize how much thought they put into even just like these beginning scenes and the uh, set design. Set design was on point. You're jealous. I mean, you're jealous. I'm really jealous. jealous. It's right. right. <laughs> 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 God, that that happened. Oh my god, it got me. Ooh, 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 I got chills. Oh no, oh my gosh. Gosh, call me, please, please. Where are you going? Where are you going? Why are you going to look at it? Yeah, yeah, my parents are from the Lake Ponico area. Why is he so distressed? Sir, can I see your license, please? Wait, why? No, 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 he wasn't driving. I didn't ask who was driving, I asked to see his ID. Yeah, why? Yeah, rude. But well, Rose, you little, you're so conniving. Uh, she knows what she's doing. She's trying to get this guy's trust. But also, cop, you got no excuse. No, I'm good. That's a nice house, though. <laughs> Hello. This is a really nice house. Oh, look at those bushes. Those two, there's four rocking chairs on the porch? That's a little weird. Oh, that's horrible. Wow. Are you guys alright? Yeah, it just fruck us out. Fruck? It must have fucked you out. <laughs> fruck us out? Yeah, I do not like the deer. I'm sick of it. They're taking over. They're like rats. They're destroying the ecosystem. I see a dead deer on the side of the road. I think to myself, that's a start. What? He, this guy doesn't like deers, I guess. You deer hater. What did that deer ever do to you? Four months. Mm. Uh, five months, actually. She's right. I'm wrong. boy. Better get used to saying that. <laughs> Maybe it's part of the act that the dad's a little bit rude. That's uh, pretty eclectic. I'm a... Eclectic. Black dude comes along, proves him wrong in front of the entire world. Amazing. Tough break for your dad, though. Yeah. He almost got over it. Ooh, gosh. When they died, uh, I just... I, I couldn't bear to let him go. 
Yeah, you couldn't. Yikes. I would have voted for Obama for a third term if I could. Best president in my lifetime, hands down. There it is. There it is. How uncomfortable that talk must have been. Well, that's okay. We don't have to talk about that. Oh my gosh, that gave me nightmares. Oh my gosh, I remember the tapping of the spoon. It starts so early. Oh, I just wanted to look at Oh my gosh, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? <laughs> Was that her like slipping through? Something! Oh gosh, the brother. She tell you about a tone collection? Oh my god. Uh, what? Ew, what? <laughs> I'm gonna go get dessert. Do you think they rehearse these dinners? That was like a little bit too ca- Whoa! Come here, baby! Oh, I hate the brother. He's so creepy. It's all about being two, three, four moves ahead. Ew, uh, why is he doing this? You're so creepy. Mm-hmm. Anything anything more you'd like to add? I told you so. Oh I swear I didn't know that. I literally caught that. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm kinda of proud of myself that I predicted that. I swear I didn't know that that was the line. Oh my gosh. There's literally fly noises and I thought it was in my room! <laughs> oh my gosh! Ah, I hate that fly noise! I thought it was in my room! <laughs> I caught it on camera of me going like this! Ah, oh god, I'm nervous and I'm sweating! Ah, I'm nervous! Oh um, I hate it, I hate it! Boy, run, run! What's crazy is that he's just standing there, like why- Turn and run! <laughs> you want to know how it works? No. 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 That's not how s hypnosis works, technically, from what I remember in my psychology class. Sink into the floor. Wait, 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 wait. Sink. What? Uh, I forgot. Oh my gosh, this happened so early in the movie. I got chills, I got chills, I got chills, I got chills, I got chills. Oh, oh my god. He literally is like in a void. He's literally in a void. <laughs> ah! They're gonna play that off as a nightmare? No way. I'm done with this movie already. I'm so scared. Uh, I'm like hot and cold at the same time because I have like chills, but it's also really, really hot outside. You know, like, I'm sweating because I'm hot, but I'm also sweating because I'm nervous. Photo op! Get that good angle, that camera angle, though. Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm filming. Oh, I you said you were done. The freak. And did it work? It will work. You were in Mrs. Armitage's office for quite some time. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I should get back to work and mind my own business. Whatever you say, whatever you say. Chris was just trying to be nice. He was just trying to make conversation. Oh, man. It begins. You ready for this? Yeah, yeah. All the cars gotta be black. Oh my gosh, and they all wear black. I lit- oh, I forgot the use of color. I can't. It's so good. Is it true? Is it better? Oh, oh my god. But now the pendulum is swung back. Black is in fashion. He honestly deserves Best Boyfriend of the Year award at this point. Like, the amount of crap that he's taking from these people. Granted, it's also kind of creepy, but also, like, there are people out in the world like this, so it's kind of crazy. Well, it was nice to meet you, Chris. Oh, awkward. Honestly, and he's showing off his body? What the freak?
it's like seeing it the second time it's like so much more obvious but you just don't know at the time when you're watching it like when you're seeing it for the first time you're just like what the freak is going on <laughs> Oh my gosh, what is this awkward silence looking up at him? That's weird. I got hypnotized last night. Nigga, get the fuck out of here. You ain't getting in my head. I know she called me off guard, right? But it's cool because I'm cured. It worked. Yeah, it worked, but it was also against your will, dude. You never want that. Yo, and it's the black people out here too. It's like all in Mr. Movement. He literally got it. Now you, yeah, you literally figured it out, Rod. You figured it out. Hello. Oh my God. Oh, she's like coming through. Oh, she's like fighting. Oh my gosh, that's such good acting. Figure it out, dude. Figure it out. I think the director's probably, because at this point I kind of figured it out, but I wasn't 100% sure, obviously, because I thought it was like super wild. They had to have like wanted the audience to figure it out at that point, you know what I mean? Like at this point, I feel like the director's like, it's in your face, like believe that this is what's happening. Do you find the being African American as more advantage or disadvantage in the modern world? Whoa. What a rude question. The chores have become my sanctuary. Awkward. Get out. This is when I figured it out. Sorry, man. Okay. Get out! So, like, he could have, like, he could have said more than just get out, right? Like, he could have been like, these people are crazy, they're using my body. Alright, I'm being nitpicky, but, like, he could have said more. When he came at me, it felt like a new one. Like you've met Logan before? No, I don't know Logan. I knew the guy that come at me. Ooh. <laughs> you want to go? Mm -hmm. Without me. Oh, Rose doesn't like that Chris is giving her a hard time. They're literally selling him. Look at it. He <laughs> have this picture. Oh gosh, this is weird and there's no talking. You all like that. I'm not gonna leave here without you. I'm not gonna abandon you again. You're not. Chris, no, don't do that. You're too kind now. Uh, you kinda abandon her. She's a weirdo. Chris, you are too good for her. Uh, too good for her. I love you. I guarantee you ain't about to. You're going to regret this decision. Ooh, ukulele. I want to get a, my own ukulele. I haven't played in a really long time. He came to the party with a white woman like 30 years old now. Sex slave! <laughs> Is everything okay? I'll tell you in the car. Oh, we gotta go right now. Is that okay? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Uh, let me go get my bag. I forget, like, what happens. Okay, girl, why would you keep all these pictures in a closet so readily available for Chris to find? Come on, you're better than this, Rose. But also, like, shoot, that's a lot of people. Oh, the guy's gonna come, the Logan guy. Right? Rose? Oh my gosh. What is your purpose, Chris? Excuse me, what? In life, what is your purpose? Not to be in this house with you anymore. Rose? I'm lucky. Why would you still trust Rose to get the keys? Get the keys yourself, Chris! Get the keys yourself! Where are those keys, Rose? You know I can't give you the keys, right, babe? I'm scared. Uh... <laughs> That's a funny voicemail. <laughs> He's gotta change that. 
For like professional reasons. Ah, I guess he's a photographer, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> oh my god. Well, you try to bite the other end. Oh, dear shadowing, I get it. The dead deer in the beginning. Woohoo, I got the chills. And if you're watching this, you're probably wondering what's going on. Well, there's no need to worry. Let's take a walk. What is this janky freaking TV though? <laughs> it's so janky. They're selling people, they can't afford like a flat screen. <laughs> sorry, I'm so sorry. Coagula. Get out of here with this coagula. Try me. I believe they've been abducting black people, brainwashing them, making them work for them as sex slaves and shit. Oh, sorry about the shit. <laughs> yes, sorry. Rod. He's like spot on though. He's spot on. Hold on a second. Then he sent me some weird picture. I'm like, she brought 200 people. Oh, white girl. Oh, they get you every time. <laughs> no, he stop. He's right. And then he just got in a cab and left his phone. Wait, you haven't seen him? Oh my gosh, this is so ah creepy. One bitch. She is lying like a mother. I know that. Ooh, that TSA shit. <laughs> this motherfucker's TSA. lying. I know why you're calling. Why is that? It's kind of obvious, don't you think? Is she trying to snatch him? Oh my gosh, she's trying to snatch him. That there's something between us? How's it going, buddy? <laughs> you can answer there's an intercom in the room. What? It's like video chat? Yeah, well, where's, where's Rose? Oh, you dirty dog. I'll control the motor function, so I'll be... Me. Uh... You'll be me. Who knows? <laughs> People want to change. Some people want to be stronger, faster, cooler. Black is in fashion. No doubt we, you know, we embrace black culture and we let it influence so many different styles. Hip hop, rap, you know, all these different genres, these different forms of creativity from the black community and black culture and black origins. And yet there's still so much of this racial discrimination towards them, whether it's by the police or by, you know, older generations, even younger generations. And it's like, it's about time that that's it's enough. And this movie was made in what, 2017? It's not like it wasn't an, it was an unknown thing, right? But it's just that people are actually caring now. It's, it's like the movie gets it spot on. It's almost like they, they can't, they can't control it. It's there. Have, they have to live as a passenger in the society where they're oppressed. Literally oppressed. Like, <laughs> this movie is spot on with that. I don't do gore well at all. I forget, is it gory? Oh, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. Let me know when it's over. Oh, that's the word. I literally, I hate gore and I hate blood. I fainted in a blood test, FYI. I fainted a blood test. It wasn't even like a blood drive or donating blood. It was like this much of blood coming out of me and like I literally uh, fainted, gone, uh, in my chair, literally. Ooh, I saw them in the corner of my eye. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes, Chris, go, but also, ooh, violence. Nice. Wait, don't take those out. Leave them in. Leave them in. Leave them in. But leave them in in case. Ooh! Ooh, that glasses reflection. They really, they really, they really be doing this to me. Ah! Gross, 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 gross. I'll blur it all out, but. He should leave those in in case the mother comes with the teaspoon thing. Full. Antler in the throat. That's all you really need to know.
Okay, okay, okay. I know I said to stab him, but also like, whoa. Zombie land, double tap. Oh, that's that. That's double tap. That's double tap. We got it. Ooh, she's having her cereal separate. That's so weird. My name's Chris. I'm sorry, sir. Can you repeat that? I'm at it. I'm at it. I'm at it. Oh, oh my gosh. There's no way she heard that. If she couldn't hear what was going on inside the house, there's no way she heard what was going on outside. He has guilt and he can't leave the person who's underneath Georgina. But is that a good idea though? Like, is that a good idea? You ruin my eye! Oh my gosh, 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 oh my gosh. <gasps> Did you guys see Georgina's scar on her head? Oh, she's okay. Um, rule number something: keep always keep your seatbelt on. Zombie land. <laughs> Can you guys tell that I like Zombie Land? <clears throat> Woo! Like I know how it ends, but I'm still scared. Oh my gosh, weird. Walter, please. Walter, please. How does she not see Chris flash it to Walter? Oh god. Oh god. Chris. I'm so sorry. Yeah, yeah, you ain't fooling anyone, girlfriend. You ain't fooling no one. Don't even get me started on this ending. Airport. Airport. It says airport. That's so good. I didn't even recognize the first time I watched it. He's a TSA cop. Good job, Rod, for going to save your friend. How'd you know the address, though? Sorry, I have to. It's like Cinema Sins did something to my brain where I have to call out everything. I told you so. I mean, I told you not to go in that house. Ah! <laughs> I love it. Full circle. How you find me? I'm T.S. Motherfucking A. We handle shit. Okay, I guess that fills in the hole. Whatever you say, Rod. Oh my gosh, this is a movie though. This is a movie. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. That's the credits. Come on, just like that end. It's so good. When I first saw that movie, like I kid you not, when Rod came up, and you don't know it's Rod and it's just a cop car. How many of you guys, just your heart sunk? A black guy standing over a white lady. Crap, there's no way out, right? Like there's, there's no way that he's, the cop is gonna listen. How sad is that? That that's the first thing that we think of when the cop car comes. But the movie sets it up perfectly and it makes you see like that shouldn't be a thing that we think of. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this movie commentary. If you did, make sure you guys hit the big thumbs up button and make sure you guys don't forget to subscribe. Let me know down in the comments below what other movies I should do next. Again, I will be putting links to different donation sites and petition sites that you can participate in today, right now, the second that this video wins. Alright, have the bestest day ever, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Okay, bye!